Hello there, this is Carlo. Welcome to another very, very quick tutorial. And today we're going to be looking at uh, grading individual objects or masking uh, in DaVinci Studio Resolve or DaVinci Resolve Studio 12. So let's get cracking. Okay, so I've got my clip loaded up into DaVinci here. And what I want to do is create my first node to start my grading. So I'm going to come up to node, add a serial node. And now I've got my basically my very first um, uh, grading option, if that makes sense. So whatever I do to this, I can grade it um, any way I sort of see fit. So now, say for instance, let's have this scenario, okay? Let's say for instance, I just want to grade this kettle, okay? And make that sort of like a little bit more punchy. Now there's an easy way to do this. What we're going to do is we're going to create a mask. Now, obviously, this is a static image. Um, if I just play it here, right? So this kettle weight moving. So if it's a moving object, obviously you're going to need to track it, and that will be in the next tutorial. I will try and show you how to track um, an object um, in DaVinci and then grade it um, again. Okay? So um, I just want to sort of focus on this kettle here. So, in order to do that, I am going to create another node here, and this is going to be my kettle node here. Okay, this is going to be my kettle node right here. Okay, which is right here. So, you sort of start on that. If you click on this little icon here, you've got a number of ways you can um, mask out your objects. You know, it's a square, circle, a line, side to side. I always use this curved one, and if you just select on that, sort of put your sort of object into position and if you click and drag if you hold and drag you create a bend if you click and drag um, you can sort of say for such a mask this you know grade this red bit of the kettle here just to make it pop a little bit more or do whatever I need to do to it so I'm just going to quickly mask that out here if I hold Now, okay, so that bit has been masked, all right? Okay, and it's showing here as one object ready to be graded or basically worked on. So now, if I go back to my curves editor or whatever grading thing I want, I can grade that object uh, independently of itself and it will not affect the rest of the footage. So I can basically grade this um, sort of any way I see fit um, for this piece of footage. So very, very, very simple, uh, very, very quick way on how to mask and grade individual objects in DaVinci. Uh, works very, very well, very, very powerful tool. Uh, but say for instance, I want to uh, grade a second object. So let's just punch it to white so we see we've done that just for fun. Um, and I'm going to create a new serial node. So you'll create a serial node for every object you want to sort of grade or work on. So then I want to go back to my mask and say, I'm thinking, I don't know, this is a bit of a circle. I can use a circle tool. Remember these are static images, so if you're, um, if you're, what's the word I'm looking for? If your object is actually moving, then you're going to need to track it so the grade tracks with it. So now that's ready to be played around with, as you can see. Right, so we're creating even a little light inside there. Um, so yeah, that's it. That's how you mask and grade with DaVinci Resolve Studio 12. I hope you found this tutorial helpful. Please remember to hit that like button and that subscribe button. And guys, I will definitely catch you in the next one. Ciao, ciao.